This clip is brought to you by BattleOnline.com. So before we wind down, because um, I know we've taken up quite a bit of your time and stuff, um, okay. cool. we wanted to ask you what was some of your favorite albums that you was a part of personally. Um. Uh. All of them, really. <laughs> um, yeah, I, yeah, because all of every everyone that I was on is it, it kind of has its own special memories. I, I you know, I recollect yeah, yeah. the moments of recording these particular songs. Um, I will say, um, of course, Life or Death, um, simply because that was the first one, and um, yeah, that. For me, that was like that was my foot in the door. Um, so uh, definitely, life or death. Um, prime suspects, um, the liquidation of the ghetto, because those was my brothers. Like, yeah, those was my brothers. So we, uh, us working because we hung together as well. So us hanging together and then coming and working together and and and. And listening to each other, like vibing off one another, you know, on, on the music or whatever, I definitely feel like their album was um, not just saying that because I was close to them, but that album was one of the ones that I'm like, y'all step on this album because uh-huh. this album. Was dope. 100%. Um, also, of course, Mercedes album. Uh, you know, that's my sister. I, I loved um, working on her album and being able to, um, I guess, write more. Uh, I did more writing on her album. So for me, that to me, my writing is a bigger gift for me than singing, actually. So um, uh, Mac, definitely working with Mac. Uh, I, I, I'll probably go down the whole roster because <laughs> between... Max, C, Mercedes. Uh, um, one of the, the one of one of the uh, biggest songs that I like to um, working on was Boonopolis. On the last done uh, on that album, you, you uh, that. simply you, because as well. So, yeah. so we, got, um, we got a bit of a delay, but um, yeah, you could. <laughs> oh, okay, yeah, Boonopolis um, was. One of one of, uh, I guess they on that album because we we knew that that album was gonna be major. Um, you know that was his double disc and yeah. So uh, I don't know. I guess I, I can't even really uh, pick and choose because, like I said, every album was its own um, experience um, and every memory. Uh, every memory is has the same effect like a wow and you know uh these are people that i genuinely love um so it's it's kind of like picking a favorite child you know i I don't have a favorite child (laughs) so you know i don't i don't i don't think i have uh a, a favorite i think as far as um Artists who I think that that I um, loved working with and would still love to work with, I think C and Mac would be up there. at the top of that list. Okay, well, yeah. you, Mac's home now, so uh, you know something uh, could potentially happen maybe in the future and stuff too. I've actually had Mac doing some vocals right. and stuff as well, and I'll be like, okay, he got he, he doing a little something too, you know, he's singing a little something. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Even now, because now I'm like, wow, even though I remember when he, um, I remember when he, uh, when he, you know, was first locked up, like we would, uh, we went to one of the first prisons that he was at and we kind of did a show or something. I can't remember it, like, but it, to see how he's developed um, instrumentally, um, how he's playing all these different yeah. instruments, it's not a surprise to me. It's not a surprise to me because that's, if you know Mac, you'll know he's Mac is the was the Nas of No Limit. So uh, it's not surprising. It's just more so like this is what the industry been missing. Like this type of talent is what the industry has been missing. So yeah, hopefully, hopefully he he uh, 
he gives and gets back what he deserves this time around when it comes to, um, you know, the music and, and the music industry. I definitely hope that he, he pulls it off. Peace, family. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, and check us out on about.online.com. Don't forget to check us out on Facebook for exclusive playlists and social media for all different types of segments and content.